Hi, my name is Machine Head, and this is Understanding Fortnite. Um, today I want to talk about the Falling Peak. A lot of people don't consider this a peak just because of how different it is, really. Basically all it is is when you are on high ground and you can catch somebody like this, you jump out and you just shoot. I noticed that when I'm in a build fight, the easiest time I have hitting somebody that's doing one of these is when I can anticipate it from really far away. If I see them jump from really high up, I can kind of see their line of flight, or their path of flight and I can easily shoot your feet and then build. Your gun is a lot higher up on your body than your feet are, so they have a hitbox for a long time before you can actually shoot. The way I like to counter this is I like to drop in the corner. Now you don't always have the option to do this, but if you can this is going to make it much more reliable to not take any damage back. So, so all you do is you get in the corner here and kind of as you're falling you want to move to the side a bit and you can see that I can control myself midair just a little bit. and. This kind of gets you out of line of sight much faster. And you're getting a little bit of a right hand um, cover advantage. Not necessarily a peak, but just a little bit of cover from the right side. See, I'm able to steer myself um, back behind cover when I do this. That wasn't a great example. Also remember that a lot of good players are not going to leave themselves open like this. And if they are doing it, they're most likely baiting. So the best way to catch somebody like this is if they're doing something else, like if they're um, editing or building, for example. One of the most common ways you might use this is during an end game rotation, where you might see a tunnel like this with a side open. You can fall down, shoot, hit yourself with a floor and a wall to protect yourself, and then ramp back up. This kind of tunnel here is very common because people don't like to waste their mats all the time, and they feel sort of safe on the mid ground from the sides because they might not see anyone. But yeah, that makes it really easy for you to drop down. That's all I wanted to show today. Uh, thanks.